Hello, sports fans, sports bettors, and YouTube Nation. John here with Ricket Picks. Hey, we didn't make it 13 in a row. Um, that was brought to you by the Random Strike Zone. Um, if you guys watched that Sunday night baseball game that finished one to nothing, um, you know, the pitch, the throwing was a ball, then it was a ball, and then all of a sudden it was strike three. Same, same, same location, same everything. Just this time it was a strike instead of the ball that it usually was. But uh, the umpire definitely controlled every aspect of that game last night. And um, the hitters were frustrated. I think pitchers, to a degree, were frustrated. But um, when you get uh, Major League Baseball hitters frustrated with the strike zone, um, it's going to be a quick night, and it's going to be a, a low-scoring night. So, you know, some in-game opportunities there if you ever see Mr. Hernandez behind the plate again, and um, he decides to have a random strike zone. And also, more case... For the robot strike zone that I believe is coming to Major League Baseball because of games like this. Uh, I really hope not, but, you know, at the end of the day, that's going to be what it's going to be. So, we take our lumps. We move on. 12-1 uh, and one over my last 13. So, I'll take that <laughs> every 13 stretch. Going to get another streak fired up right here. Going back to Major League Baseball. We got the Cleveland Indians <sighs> taking a long trip from New York out to Anaheim. Los Angeles, wherever they flew into, probably L.A., to take on the Angels. Um, Angels, their season, uh, it's kind of been up and down. Just kind of the podunking along so far. They're 9-7, and seven, mostly winning, um, surprising a few in the process. They got Lorenzen going on the mound for them. He is 1-1 one one on the season, uh, 4.82 ERA. Uh, walks and hits per inning of point. Eight five seven. That's really good. Going over to the Cleveland Indians side. Excuse me, Cleveland Guardians. It's gonna really take a long time to figure that out. Ugh, more politics. Anyways, they're seven and eight on the season. Uh, nine and six to the over under. Bieber's going for them. Um, first start didn't go as he had planned, but then you know he bounces right back. It's what he does. He's one and zero on the season. Team's 2-1 and one in his starts. Um, they're on a two-game winning streak. 2.81 ERA. Walks and hits per inning of .688. Uh, when you look at the overall body of work of both these pitchers, um, they both have the capability to go out and shut this game down for a while. You look at lineups and you're like, Ooh, the Angels lineup looks pretty tough. It does. Their overall success against Beaver, not that good. You look at Cleveland's lineup, and they got some pretty tough hitters. And then you look at their overall success against Lorenzen in their careers, and it's not that good. Um, but I, I expect this to be a low-scoring game in the first five innings, but I do expect the Indians to emerge. Um, I'm taking them on the money line because it's minus 106. Um, they're actually getting a half a run in the first five, but that's like minus 160 or something. There's a lot of no-run first innings for today that are up in the 170 era. Did not take the books long to catch on to the nerfies. But your official Ricketts diamond paw pick for this game. I'm going Cleveland Indians first five money line. Cleveland Guardians first five money line. It is going to take forever to figure that out. I'm just going to say Cleveland. Cleveland on the first five money line. That's all I got. Minus 106. One unit. Hit that thumbs up button for me. Sorry for calling them their old name. It's going to happen a few times more before I get it figured out that they're the Guardians now. It's just weird. My whole entire life of 44 years, they've been one name, and now it's different. And, ugh. Ah. Don't even get me started. Anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Hit that thumbs up button for me. Drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know who you got for the day. Thank you very much for watching this video. And most importantly, good luck with your bets.